Switzerland is first. Sasha Cohen third. And on the ice right now in second place after the short program, Jennifer Kirk from Newton, Massachusetts. She landed seven triple jumps in the qualifying round, and she has seven more planned right here. She has been so consistent all week, opening up with her favorite jump, the triple south cow. That's right, Susie. All week, she has just been solid. She hasn't missed, I haven't seen her miss more than maybe two jumps all week, if any. It's fun to watch because you really trust her in the performance. Exactly. Coming up here on a triple lutz double toe. Very nicely done, very solid. Now this next combination will be a key combination for her if she wants to try and go for the gold medal. It's a triple toe, triple toe. One of the only girls to do a triple, triple combination in this competition, and she pulls right. it off. She rotates so fast. Does she remind you a little bit of uh, Tara Lipinski? Uh, she does. She spins so fast in the air. consistent in the jumps, but her performing qualities, her footwork, she's really a young skater. You can see the potential when she gains more strength. She's just so capable. Coming up here, one of the more difficult jumps, a triple flip. And another nice triple flip, nice landing. And you can see that smile on her face. She knows she's doing a good program here so far. As you watch her land triple after triple after triple, keep in mind she is a sophomore in high school. She's been able to keep up because the school gives her the assignments ahead of time, and she does them on her own when she's on the road competing. Setting up here for a triple loop. Very nicely done. Like the two ladies that have skated before her, she has now landed six triple jumps. She's got a great program going here. All she needs to do is carry it through to the end. favorite jump that you saw in the beginning. She's going to put it in a jump sequence, double axle. This is called a half loop, which is a connective jump into the triple lutz. That is so hard to do at the end of the program. It's jump sequences take a lot of energy. And that makes the triple count seven. into this final combination spin. Wow. <laughs> Poised and focused. It doesn't look like she's ever going to fall again. <laughs> I spoke with her coach, Heavy and Mary Scott Fold, and they said she's very consistent in practice. This is how she skates every day. Coming up here, the most difficult triple-triple combination that we will see today, the triple-toe, triple-toe. First triple-toe, nice. Pops up nicely into that second triple-toe. At the very end of the program, she steps up into a double axle, which is two and a half revolutions, a very difficult double. This is a half loop right there, just a connective jump. Beautiful on the triple sow cow. She really had everything together, the full package. First set of marks for Jennifer Kirk. Five, six, Very impressive marks five, there. Six, five, six, 
Not so sure about the 5 1, but the rest of the marks. Where'd that come from? <laughs> The audience won't let that judge forget it. Of course not. Thank you. The marks for presentation. And now the marks for presentation. And these put Jennifer into first place ahead of Sarah Meyer. Evie and Mary Scott hold also delighted with those scores. She is one skater away from a possible gold medal and uh, I think she might know it. And that skater is her teammate and the leader after the short program, Deanna Stellato. She is 16 years old and perhaps the most focused of all the skaters here, the last one.